Well, starting today, a team of researchers from the Scripps Institution of Oceanography exploring the deepest parts of the California coast to find new life and possibly new medicine. ABC 10 News reporter Jared Aaron shows us how people at home can join them on these deep dives. This is a live stream of the exploration vessel Nautilus, an oceanic research ship. You can see it's pretty empty right now, but pretty soon it's going to be bustling with activity and taking you along for the ride. Every time we go to a new place, we discover something new. Lisa Levin is a professor of biological oceanography at UC San Diego's Scripps Institution of Oceanography. She's leading a team of researchers on a mission to explore the deepest parts of the California coast, looking at what animals can survive a mile below the surface, what minerals are there, and how they can make our lives better. To look at the potential of these microbes to produce chemicals that can cure cancer, or provide aid industrial processes. There's a variety of ways that humans might be able to use these. They'll send this remote operated vehicle, Hercules, to collect samples and take pictures. As it dives, it will send back a live video feed that anyone who wants to can watch online, letting everyone take part in the mission. We believe very important to make the public aware of what's in the deep ocean and why it's important, why they should care about it, and there's no better way than allowing people to view it with their own eyes. Coronavirus postponed the trip from June to October, and because of limited crew size, they can only do eight hours of exploration each day. But Levin says any new discovery will be worth the extra hassle. So I'm really hoping we, we find some really new cool organisms and we find all the kinds of rocks that we're looking for. The team will do nine straight days of deep dives. To watch it live, go to nautiluslive.org. And we've put that link on our website, 10news.com. Jared Ahrens, ABC 10 News. Very cool story, Jared. Thank you so much. And the samples from this mission will be put into the archives at Scripps so you, they can be used for future studies about the ocean floor.